another day of Advent at La Lande and one of the ones that I've been looking forward to the most because today is the day that we are going to be decorating the winter salon. We have been using this room for Christmas for years now so for me it is the heart of Christmas in the chateau. We have lots of our old Christmas decorations and we're adding a couple of new ones to them this year because this year's Christmas theme is La Lande Tartan. So in a moment you will discover how we have managed to make tartan specifically La Lande in style but you'll see we did manage to do it with Andy's help. We have a tree to decorate now, yes. but first I think we need some, some sustenance, a bit of strength. Andrew has brought us all pizzas so that whilst we're decorating the tree, we can sit and have pizza. And I think that we need to get the Yule Aquavit that we were sent last year and we haven't had yet in that beautiful little decanter. We're going to go full on Christmas here now. We have our snacks, we are good to go. This is possibly the most important part of the preparations. Oh, I see you brought enough wood for one of your massive and now famous teepees. I want to get it started. Quickly. No messing around. Every time, you get it every time, first time. That's stunning. Amory, I don't want to put pressure on you. But Jared is wearing a blanket right now. Yeah. <laughs> he's, not, he's not very prepared for winter though, right? Yeah. No. We can't lose Jared. He's critical to Christmas at La Lande. Oh. <laughs> Philip's brought down the lady and the unicorn plates. We have pizza, which I actually I've already been digging into. And oh, you've just upped the ante. Ah, oh, you put it in! Yes. Oh, great. So this is the Yule Aquavit that we were sent last year and didn't have. And we have put it in the really gorgeous decanter that we were also sent, the Christmas decanter, with matching, of course, Christmas shot glasses. Got little stars and robins on. Do you speak no Norwegian? I do not speak Norwegian and we don't have Marie, which we need Marie. I, I can understand a little bit. From 1988, until forever. Okay, no arguing with that. But Philip, I, I can see that we've started with the most important things, pizza and alcohol. What about the tree? Well, you said it right, we're starting with this. <laughs> <laughs> Who wants to, oh, look at that, look at that top. Mm -hmm. Isn't that gorgeous? It's 40%, can you tell? It's, you can light the uh, heat drop that. <laughs> <laughs> There you go, Amory. For all night. I know that yeah. you'll be happy to try. <laughs> Never say no to liquid. Jared, to warm the inside as mm -hmm. well as the outside, doing the job of the blanket. Perfect for uh, a dry. Like three minutes. <laughs> yeah, 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 I think I'll be the same as you. Thank you. Cheers, everybody. <laughs> Merry Advent. Merry Advent. Merry Advent. Merry Advent. Oh, Merry Advent. To another tree. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh. Yes. Uh, oh, that's lovely. Uh, rummy. Mixed reactions here. I absolutely love oh. it. Jared, Jared <laughs> suffering. <laughs> no. no. Okay. <laughs> that sofa don't like it. I love it. Yeah. You love it. What does it taste like? It's soft. It's soft. Yeah. It's soft. It's soft. It's soft. It's not this. I can survive the winter with it. It's very good with pizza in the morning. Good. <laughs> I'm definitely not cold anymore. <laughs> Well, if the tree's over there, you'd be able to see it from the courtyard through the window. Exactly. So Emma is saying as well, we should just put it there. And I'm agreeing yes. with him because then the, the loo is not obstructed. You're all against me. Oh. For years, the tree has been in that corner. Change is good. This is communal living stuff, mate. Why? Deep breath, deep Christmas breaths. The bathroom wasn't in use before. That's please. true. And you had an entrance for the winter. Yes, which we're now not using. Have it. So I think this year it could be. I'm just worried about the draft. Is it yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> it's very Christmassy though. That's true. <laughs> I'm willing to try it. Right. <laughs> Here comes the tree. It's like the arrival of Father Christmas. Careful that little lip yes. behind you. Come into the warmth. It's glacially cold outside today. Oh my goodness, me. It's really exciting. Well, I've never seen a tree arrive like this before. It wheels out of the box. Oh, it's in two halves as well. This is incredible. A lot of baubles coming in over there. 
There you go. That is amazing. Philip, what do you think? I love it. It's transformative, it's so isn't it? It suddenly feels like a chateau, doesn't it? I know. It's gorgeous. <laughs> it's so much better than the other light. I feel like so... I need to go over the billiard table. Definitely, but it wasn't for a this salon. <laughs> and people kept hitting their heads, and I don't think it will happen. No, like this. this is so much better. It's higher up. Oh, I love it, love it, love it. Okay, now let's get a Christmas tree up. There have been so many interruptions today. We're never going to get this tree up at this rate. I know all I want to do is sit and stare at it as well. Lovely Christmas sparkles. It's almost as though that's the only bit of Christmas decorating we needed here. I didn't know who did this, by the way, but... Look. Oh, I didn't see it! Horatio, I don't know who did it? <laughs> I thought it was really cute. That may well be my favourite Christmas decoration of the year. Well, we've got this new tree. We don't know how it works. And knowing you, you won't let us try and work it out before reading the instructions. I've already read the instructions. Oh, yeah. look at you go. Are yeah. oh, there gloves in the pouch? I love the gloves. in. Oh, there's gloves. We've got the gloves. But this time we also have a remote. Our tree comes with a remote. No way. Yep. Yep. I think it would do anything though until we plug it in. <laughs> is it me or is our tree upside down? <laughs> it is. But I'm confused. It should be fixed in the set. Seems somewhat counterintuitive this entire process. This thing. Do we leave it's on? It's a thing. I thought you'd read the instructions. The fox looks like he's got a better idea of what to do than you. He's laughing at you, Philip. Oh. 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 <laughs> no. Is this what you're supposed to be doing? Yeah. Then it's what I'm supposed to be doing. I think a lot of tree branches are about to fall on your head. Yeah. There goes Philip. Wow. Darling. Yes. Do you mind just pushing the branches up slightly for me? It's also you're not like living in the tree. No, these ones that are on, on, on my head, please. Oh, those ones. I, I thought random branches. Hello. Hello. Yes, it just came on. There was a bit of a scary pause there, but it's on. Oh, look at that! The way it just lights up the minute it touches it. That's really clever. It's massive. Yeah. I really like it. It fits this room so perfectly. It's the right height. Yeah. And look what I see out of the window. Just as we start decorating, it started snowing for the first time this month. It is absolutely meant to be. I ran outside as soon as I saw the snow. It may only be a little bit, but that's it. It is officially Christmas. I wasn't sure we'd get any snow in December this year. I love it. Hold up, I am on my way, I'm in motion Let's go to the ocean Yeah, let's go outside We can hang out on the beach without freezing Yeah, isn't that amazing? In Christmas time We'll be chilling and having a good, good time Doesn't matter if the snow is falling Or the windows in the rain is falling We love the tree as it is, but I think it needs a bit more gold. So we first came up with the idea of cutting up this tinsel because I don't love it when it's draped across. And we're just going to add little bits of this, which has got gold that can sparkle through. Try and get your nose up. Philip's just putting the finishing touches to the garland. It's gorgeous, Philip. Do you like it? Yes, okay. the little Father Christmases. And that's one of the stunning Russian ones that we were sent in the past. Oh, look at this bauble. It's just like Father Christmas's belly. Just the belly. Yes. It's idyllic, Philip. With the fire as well. This is the place to be. It's gorgeous. Like oh, that. you put baubles on the horses above the doors. Yes, they're holding them out. And I love the tartan bunting over the garland. Yeah. Good, good time. Doesn't matter if the snow is falling. And the tree is incredible. It does feel Christmassy, doesn't it? I love it so much. I think that the tinsel really helped. Mm. It's so sparkly now. That one I really like, but yeah. my favourite one, I think, is this one. It's just so sparkly. And it's huge. Yes. Do you think Jerry would approve? 
I hope so, because Scott Lang's the main inspiration for the tree. Jerry's actually coming to join us at Christmas, which he can't often do, so I wanted to make a big fuss. As you can see from the baubles on the tree and the tartan blanket used as a tree skirt, we're going for a tartan theme at Lalande this year. It's going to feel cosy and snug and my Scottish heritage is coming out. That's why I obviously needed this top. And we've created our own Lalande tartan with Andy. She's done the most beautiful job. It's a gorgeous tartan overlaid with the creatures of Woodland Watch and of course the chateau and chapel. And one of the things that I love most about it is that from a distance it looks as though it's a tartan that's just been covered with little dots of snow. We have three different versions of it. One is the plain Lalande tartan that was actually hand painted by Andy and that we've made into a repeat. The other is the Woodland Watch tartan that's just got the animals on it. And then of course we have the Lalande Christmas tartan which has all the little creatures as well as the chateau and the chapel. And that's what we're going to be using to wrap our presents this year. And Philip's also used it to make origami tree decorations. Philip's printed out lots of sheets of paper of the Lalande tartan. This is the one with the little Woodland Watch creatures. And he's just made loads of origami stars. It's a really simple way of decorating the tree. Very cost effective as well. And they're gorgeous. They're all over the tree. It's really cute. I like your stars, Philip. They are adorable. Thank you. It's the badger. And a squirrel and a hedgehog. That's a very good star. I love this tree. I love these colours. I love the tartan. It, to me, it's just, it screams Christmas. Far more than the pink one did, actually. This, this is Christmas colours for me. If you'd like to join us in using the Lalande tartan, then you can download it at shop.chateaudelalande.com. I will put that on the screen here. And then you can use it for any projects. You can either take it to a professional printer's to have printed into wrapping papers, or just do what Philip did, print it out on your home printer and then use it for various projects. The only thing I would say is that we printed it out matte because we wanted it to look like actual fabric in the tree but I think it would look really pretty glossy and I think we might try to do some glossy ones as well next. I'd like that. One finishing touch because there's no gifts under the tree yet I think that Lalande's 2022 teddy that we were sent and she is adorable should go in there just to keep the space warm for the gifts. She's adorable. Now it feels like a Christmas tree. good job of decorating this room. So I've created a little celebration just for the room's decorators and a little gnome who Aww. wanted to come along as well. He looks very peckish, doesn't he? He does. He's waiting for us to dig into this unbelievable chocolate. This was sent as a gift. Look at that. Oh, chocolate! I am very excited about the uh, sweets in it. I don't want to break into it because it's so pretty. Okay, just do it. Okay, I'm doing it. I'm doing it. Oh. Oh, really good. <laughs> I love it. The gnome loves it. Everyone's happy. I declare the 2022 Christmas room open. Wonderful. Job well done. Cheers. Cheers. Merry, Merry Advent, everyone. It is Christmas in